Hey guys, it's JC's Reborn Journey here. So I'm just continuing with part two with um, the baby's um, nursery tour. So I was able to finally put that thing back in here, which is nice. So I'm just going to go real quick and show you everything in here. So um, I, I really showed you basically everything that's in these drawers. But I'll do that again for those that didn't get to see. So this is summer stuff. Basically, it's outfits that are summer. So it's like um, shorts with onesies that had a t-shirt or just t-shirts and shorts. So this is all summer stuff. This I can't open because it's got some stuff in the back that I can't show you. But um, they have long sleeve um, button down shirts. I, I only have two in here right now that I even had up. Um, I think that those would be really nice in the summertime if you didn't want to have like a whole like, especially in your diaper bag or if you're out nice, you know, if, you, if they already had a nice shirt on and they got some spit up or whatever and you just had to change their nice shirt. Or if it just got cool but not too cool, you know what I mean? You could kind of just put one of those kinds of shirts. But if you are wanted them to look nice, half decent, you know what I mean? So um, that's what the, this is all about. Um, and then, so then this is down here. So I have just a couple of um, hats that are just um, accessible to the changing table. So, like, if you just wanted to grab it at a hat, there's just a couple right here. And then I decided to just stick these in there. I don't really use them that much, but I just don't have a place to put those. And because I had the nappies, the dirty nappy things, um, I just figured that went well. And then we have our pee and our poo things, so that just goes perfectly with, you know, when you're changing the baby, so... Yeah. And then this will have a meaning, but I can't talk about it right now. And then this, I mentioned this one before in another video, but I said it wrong. Um, I said it, it's um, preemie sleepers, but they're actually not sleepers, they're gowns. So this is preemie gowns, and then in the back I have... Um, feet, um, the girl gowns but there's just not enough girl gowns right now but they're all preemies so if I have to relocate them later on I will um, this right here um, this I actually made this will probably end up not going to probably end up being a blanket it's probably going to be like for one of the miniatures to kind of just lay on and it's just a cute little Winnie the Pooh thing um and then we have this thing that I made too. So that's what that thing is there for. Now this could probably be used more as a blanket or even as a play mat. Almost like, you know, they can just lay on it and kind of just play around. So that would be cute. Or like, yeah, like something so they can, they don't have to like kind of go on the floor or something. You know what I mean? But anyways, this has got, um, so that's more for like your preemies. But these have your taggies, and um, so these are all my handmade taggies that were made by friends, and love this one. So this was um, done by Reborn Doll Obsessed. Thank you so much. Love it. And um, then I got this through one of the dolls I bought, and then... Um, yeah, I just, this is really cute. I gotta show you this. It's just a small little mi miniature, like, blanket, but it's got Winnie the Pooh on it. So it's like a little lovey. So it can either be for, like, a toddler, a baby, or it can wrap one of the miniatures up. So, it's just cute. Anyways, so, moving on. So these are all the, we have toddler boy socks and then Jackson socks I think that's right right yeah and then we have girl socks here 
So that's the infant girl socks. Yeah, that one's going to have to go down there. And then all boy socks. I don't think there's enough. So, still don't have enough to choose from yet. And then these are like your... Um, you know, like your these. Like your button-down things. Your t-shirt button-down ones. Um... What else? Your, um, basically that kind of stuff. It can have some t shirts, has boy t shirts in there, um, tankies, these are tanks right here, long sleeve shirts. That's basically shirts, has a swim shirt in there. And then this one, that guy drives me nuts, this one is, um, I think he just revs his engine to be a jerk. Um, <laughs> anyways, so this one right here is for um, outfits, so they all match each other. But sometimes, like some of the outfits have, like this right here has has a matching jacket, but the jacket's gonna go in the jacket pile. So I decided to put the jackets all in here because um, they don't take as much room when you do it this way. I feel like they take up a lot of room when you put them in there and stuff. So I figured um, for the most part just putting all the boy jackets in here will really, um, you know, and rolling them really um, decreases the clutter in here. So I got my preemie jackets, and then you got your newborn size. You kind of just want to have your sizes in order here. And then I got my sweaters in the back, as you can see. So you kind of know where you're... Well, I got some sweaters here, too, so... But the reason why I also have them here, a um, couple of reasons. One, um, I've been having a hard time... Um, I'm trying to find ways to get myself to use certain things I don't really use. So I figured if the thing is right here and the baby's right here, it makes it easier, right? So um, possibly grab at it. So I also put the lovies, the little doggies and the little lovies and stuff in here. Because I wanted them to have their own little spot and something easy for me to grab at, at at an easy location too. Like something where I don't have to grab at it real hard. And then here, I have a hard time putting um, gowns on the babies. So I wanted to put the gowns in a location that was really easy. And you know what, that's a really smart way to do it because... They're right here, the baby's right here, you change them at night and you're perfect, you're ready to go. You know what I mean? So, that was why I did that. So, anyways, um, I still gotta figure out a better way for the, um, I'm not even gonna show you, but down there in, in that box right there is where all the mittens are. All the hand mittens. And I don't really use hand mittens, so I need to get better at doing that. And then these are all the burp cloths. So burp cloths for boys, burp cloths for girls. And then I put the two powders that I use here. Um, one's dry wipes, one's wet wipes, travel wipes. Those are for taking pictures and stuff. And then toddler diapers and then the toddler honest diapers and stuff. So, and then there's dry wipes right here, because they dry out anyways, if you put wet wipes in there. And then I have preemie diapers right here. Those are for my, um, my, um, baby that now can wet himself, so it makes it easier. And then I have, um, my comb and my little traveler thing and powder and I need a better one of those and stuff like that yeah so then I wanted to show you really quickly up here I'm pretty sure I've shown you before 
I'll show you again. Got my cloth diapers here. Got the girl clothes up here. I'm really trying to utilize everything and then the toys are in there. I'm not even gonna bother opening it. So I don't really open that. And then um, I have, like these are the toddler. I only kept a few of the toddler ones out. Um, and sometimes I just wanna throw um, a quick, one, quick bottle as well. Um, you know when I'm done using a bottle and I don't feel like putting it away so um, now we're up to this side so I fixed up here a little bit better um, here are basically my magazines from scrapbooking to reborning stuff like that and then I got my reborning DVDs baby book name things and then right up here is the miniature, um, miniature miniatures like these babies. I don't know if you can see them, but those babies, um, clothes, and I don't have much. And then I have, um, these empty bottles in here. And then I have the baby medicine and then baby food. And I do sell baby food, um... You don't want to put it on your baby directly. Um, you use um, press and seal wrap so it can't be on contact. I know some people put baby food, baby food on their babies on contact and that's not good for them. Um, so anyways, we have this right here and I have actually my miniature baby diaper bags right there and then I have diapers that like are you that need to be you know that are used that those these are the ones I go for first because these diapers um, are brand new so I'm trying not to touch these first I'm trying to go at these other ones first but sometimes I need to grab them my thing is though, I need to get more size 2 diapers. That's my problem. Because I'm noticing some of my babies need a size 2. So I need to invest. I have some size 2's. It's not like I don't. But I want some honesty size 2 diapers. But um, yeah, and then I just have some other stuff up there. But that's basically, that's basically it. I mean, I have this stuff that I, this is all the stuff I made for my miniature babies. Um, and that's really it, um, just letting anybody know that is, um, oh yeah, I didn't even show, let me see, we have all my bottles here in this drawer, and then all, one of my little guys, clothes in there and I don't even know what's in this drawer oh yeah and then some more clothes my toddler's clothes in there but um let's stop the shaking for a second and have a seat and talk for one second before I end this because I want to be very clear um Here we go. So I just want to be very quick and very, um, I'm going to be very blunt, but I'm going to be very quick about this. Um, I've been in the reborn community for two years now, so I, I know that some people, when they look at my stuff and they go, oh, I'm jealous and this, that, and the other thing, um, I don't want people to go oh my god she's got a lot of money and oh my god I want this and oh my god can you give me that and oh my god this that and the other thing I've been in the reborn community for two years so the things that you're seeing I'm either sacrificing things like I'm not going out I don't go out to eat I don't do stuff etc so I just want to let you guys know that so thanks for watching